approaching a minute remaining in this first half. The steal by Bryant. Two on one. He has Stoudemire. It's kind of a uh, slow motion two on one fast break. Howard is called for the foul. Kobe letting the play develop. Second on White Howard. There is Muhammad. Met him on a few occasions and you know, just to be in his presence, yes. Coach, it's it's I mean it's mind blowing. It's uh you, know, you start thinking of everything that he has gone through and you know, he still puts on a brave face. You know, Marv, I had a chance when I was playing for the Sixers as a young player. He lived in Cherry Hill, New Jersey, and we were at a dinner together, and I sat next to him for about four hours, and all he did was draw pictures of Joe Frazier <laughs> and just was talking the whole time, and I actually got an autograph. I said, would you sign this for my son, Chris, who was like two years old at the time, three. I went to Chris's house recently, and we had it framed up in his room. It was pretty neat. I had a different experience with uh, <laughs> Muhammad back in my uh, boxing days at, at NBC as uh, Dwight Howard is, is fouled. He will head to the line. We actually visited his home to do a feature. And all he wanted to do, you know, he sees himself as a uh, an amateur magician. Yes. He kept saying, I can do levitation. <laughs> <laughs> and he was claiming he was doing it. I've yet to see it. No. <laughs> I, I don't know what was going through his mind. <laughs> One of our staff members said, okay, I'm levitating. <laughs> Never saw it. But he was a great host, and we, we really had a, a, a terrific time. His great sense of humor. When people talk about true greatness, mm -hmm. it's Muhammad Ali. True greatness. West with a 68-67 lead. Final minute, first half. Nice play. Don't get on the hop for one. And the ball back to the west. Well, I was wrong about Bill Russell. No hesitation about getting to that cake. When you got 11 rings, you can do whatever you want to do, Marv. You want some cake, he's going to eat some cake. You know, I was thinking about it, too. He was a player coach. You know, I would coach if I could play like him, too. You'd be a player coach. Pretty play. Nice reverse by Paul. Yes, Red Auerbach putting the team in his hands. Yes. Be nice to be able to coach and be the best player at the same time. Can you imagine these days being a player coach? No, no. It cannot happen. No. I think a lot of players think they're doing that, but it's not. <laughs> Some are. <laughs> Final seconds, first half. Usually teams did it to save money. Yes, right. Back in the, uh, back in the 50s. And here is Paul. So that's the end of the first half. The West with a 72-67 lead. The West squad shooting 56% from the field. The high point man, Paul Pierce, putting up 14 points in just 12 minutes. LeBron James with 10. Kobe Bryant leads the West with 13. 10 apiece for Amari Stoudemire and Paul Gasol. Let's go to Craig with Kobe. Well, a couple of you told us before the game, usually the intensity comes in the fourth quarter, but you guys came out from the very start, played a lot of defense, you put up a lot of shots. What was your focus going into the game? Well, we all just want to come out and play. You know, just play, do what we do, and uh, compete. I think that's what the fans really want to see. They want to see us get after it a little bit. What was it like having Shaquille O'Neal as your teammate again, and what did you think of his dance with the uh, Waka Jobbies? <laughs> well, yeah. Well, he's a great dancer. So I, I've seen that all before. And uh, you know, it's fun being out there with him again. How important is it for you guys to take the ball down low, get into the paint with their speed and quickness? Oh, it's very important. You know, we can't turn the ball over either. We turn the ball over and they're gone. All right, thanks a lot. Kobe Bryant leading the West to a lead here at that intermission. But coming up, it's the T-Mobile Halftime Report, a live performance from John Legend and a special ring ceremony. Kobe Bryant and his Olympic teammates receiving special rings for winning the gold at the 2008 Beijing Summer Games.